guys um i just woke up not too long ago and i am so sick i've been sick the past five days and it's not covid i thought it was covid um i got tested like five times each day i would test myself because i have the at-home kids but then i also heard that the at-home kids are not reliable because they're not as accurate so I don't know what to believe. I don't know if I have it. I don't know if I just have the regular flu. A lot of people were telling me that I just have like a regular common flu. But this common regular flu has been the worst that I've ever felt in my entire life. I was sick in bed. I was on bed rest for like 40 straight guys. I'm telling you, it has been by far the worst sickness I've ever had. But I'm finally coming out of it. By the way, I haven't gone anywhere. I haven't seen anyone. My grandma just left to my mom's house. Um, unfortunately, Evie got sick first, and then he passed it to me. And Fernando never gets sick. Like, I don't know if it's because he's a guy or because God just chose him not to ever get sick. Because one thing about Fern is he's never going to get sick. Like, And if he does get sick... He like barely has any symptoms and I'm just so jealous of him. I'm like, I wish I could be like you. Cause I feel like when I get sick, I get sick like I'm on my deathbed, pretty much. So anyways, I'm feeling so much better though. Um, I just decided to straighten my hair. I'm really, really excited because Today I am getting my couches in. I know I took you guys with me um, when I want to go buy them. So they are finally getting delivered. I actually have a few furniture pieces um, coming in. But everything is so delayed. I don't know if it's because of COVID or because what. But I ordered a table like back in January. And it's basically going to get here till July. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to cancel that order. And just find something that I really want and see what the like shipping issue is and hopefully I can get something in quicker because I really need a table for that like by my kitchen right by my kitchen is like an empty like space so yeah I'm gonna just uh, bring you guys along my day okay so we're getting rid of this carpet I'm also getting rid of the coffee table I'm redoing everything guys um, so just one step at a time because like i said everything is so on back ordered and delayed along with this um piece right here they said that they can't come start fixing it until two more months what's the matter baby it's okay my love so they're on their way oh so my couches should be on their way right now i'm just so excited to slowly start getting my house together. It's a lot, you guys, especially to fill up a huge, huge house like this. It takes a lot of time and it takes a lot of money and just everything. Sometimes I just want to give up and I'm like, Ugh, I can do it. So bear with me, guys, and be patient with my home. What are you eating? Ceviche. Made by? My baby. Babe, I don't know. This one, go this one goes well for breakfast when I'm hungover. <laughs> I feel like I can't eat it anymore. I, <clears throat> I made ceviche last night and I decided to eat it for breakfast. And Fern's like, uh uh. I'm gonna be hungover, I'm telling you. <laughs> you miss your regular breakfast? In the morning, I need eggs and all that. Well, guess what? Make it. Yeah, God give you two legs and two hands. I only need my hands to give me my legs. Well, you do need your legs too, so you can walk oh, back okay. and forth. Yeah. So, yeah. high five. Next time you pull out the couches in. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> you guys, our couches are here. I'm so excited. Look at all this space. This is like, what, baby? You guys, these. Oh my goodness, Heavy. You scared? Whoa, you guys, these are so huge. Really big. I don't know what I was thinking, but they're big. <laughs> right? I don't think you want them to be. Well, yeah, but like, 
I, I, I just gotta decorate it. I just need to like. Do you always have a phone? <laughs> I'm afraid I was tired of my shit. The no, but. The one's been in the last two years. Oh, no, it's because I gotta decorate and like the entertainment center. I feel like if the entertainment center was done, then it would look like but oh, just like fucking knock this whole bitch out of the build it. But look who's breaking in the couch already. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Do you like it? Yeah, these are huge, guys. It took up. It took up the whole living room. Now it makes my living room look small. Oh God! Look, good luck. Oh my goodness! getting lots of questions regarding my anxiety and how I've been mentally and I've been doing so much better guys I have been seeing a therapist with cerebral I don't know if you guys have ever heard of cerebral cerebral is an online mental health platform that provides prescription medical management counseling and therapy I'm very grateful that they are sponsoring today's video because I was like so shocked that they wanted to work with me because I was already getting help with cerebral and i'm like oh my god what are the odds like of this just i don't know that was so ironic so let me just give you guys a little in depth into cerebral and how it's helped me out thank you so much to cerebral for sponsoring today's video if you are one to experience depression anxiety insomnia and so forth um cerebral is highly recommended for you all for a flat monthly rate treatment for adhd bipolar and ptsd are available in certain states. Cerebral allows you to do visits with your provider, your therapist, and your care counselor online from the comfort and privacy of your own home. It's most convenient for you. And you guys can also message your team at any given moment. So it's like you have your team right in your pocket. And in most cases, you guys can see a prescribing provider fast as little as in 20 minutes. For me, the reason why I chose Cerebral was because I didn't have to drive so far to see a therapist. And I don't have to see a therapist in person. I could just do everything online. And it's so much quicker and faster, guys. It's a lot faster to see someone online versus um, having to schedule uh, weeks in advance appointments and so forth. And I really love the privacy that Cerebral comes with. The care team at Cerebral works together to create the best treatment plan for you. Your therapist, your care counselor, and your prescriber are all talking to each other, which doesn't really happen at a traditional setting. And I know a lot of you guys are going to ask me um, if it's affordable and if it is covered through insurance. Um, it's affordable and it is also covered through insurances. You can start on Cerebral with or without insurance. However, Cerebral is in network with certain insurers. And therapy with Cerebral can cost three times less the amount of a traditional therapist, especially if you don't have insurance coverage. As you guys already know, I have been dealing with my anxiety and my insomnia really bad for a few months now, and I just needed to get some help. So I discovered Cerebral um, on, a TikTok, on the TikTok platform, and I was like, wow, I need to just see someone as soon as possible because my insurance um was taking up to two months appointments and i was like oh no 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 this is not gonna work out i was in desperate need and when i ran into cerebral i was like oh my god yes this is like online this is so perfect and i met with a therapist whom i still have in contact with and literally guys i just started explaining everything and and also my insomnia started getting worse like i don't know what started getting worse my anxiety or my insomnia i think my insomnia um started getting worse and the more lack of sleep i got um the more anxiety i would deal with every single day in my daily like 
my daily life and oh my god you guys like it was so horrible don't get me wrong you guys i still experience my anxiety and insomnia but i've been doing so much better guys like i'm so proud of myself because those few months were really really hard on me i never really experienced a lot of anxiety the way i did these the last like three four months um, it was so difficult guys like I would cry every night to Fern and to my family I just really wanted to go back to my normal self, but I feel like once you experience anxiety I feel like it's so hard for you not to ever get it, but what does help is you controlling it um, like getting it under control and managing it better so I feel like I'm to that um, I control it so much better now um, and you know I'm so happy with Cerebro like getting that extra help that I needed um, also getting prescription uh, medicine prescribed to me uh, for my insomnia anxiety that also has helped so I'm super thankful super easy to choose a plan you guys all you have to do is answer some simple questions for example I just chose that I was having difficult um, sleeping and I was dealing with lots of anxiety and it just asks a lot of personal questions and it'll ask you what plan you want depending on your budget and your needs so there is medication and care counseling plan or a medication and therapy plan or if you just need a therapy plan itself so it's super easy guys you just have to answer the question decide what plan fits best for you cerebral is on the app store and the google play stores it's super important to prioritize your mental health guys and i strongly recommend you guys get help it's always best to put you first and that's why for me i always like to express how i'm feeling to my partner to my family to you guys so if you would like to take a next step on bettering your mental health click the link in my description to get started on the questionnaire and get connected with your provider right away your first month starts at only 30 dollars, guys that is so worth it especially if you need the help go for it guys i highly recommend it okay y'all so i want to show you guys like i had way more covid tests so look these are the ones saying negative so i had way so i had way more covid tests but i actually threw them away because i didn't think i needed them but these were from the last two days saying that they're negative um so here i am gonna take another one it's already been six days i think by the sixth day i should be able to know if i freaking have covid or not um because i have been quarantined and i'm just like should i like quarantine or like i honestly think it's a sinus infection um because my sinuses right now are so bad but i don't know guys like i really don't know i don't want to go to the doctors because at this point you're on your own and the er takes forever and they just send you back home so we're gonna take this Let's see oh my god i hate this part <laughs> oh my god Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <coughs> oh, I've done this so many times now. Alright, and then you're just gonna swish it in here six good times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see. Alright, and then I think you wanna leave it in there. Okay. Okay, guys, I think we waited enough, so we're gonna try to squeeze out. All of the juice. I trust me. I've done this so many times now that I already know how to do it. Okay. Then we're gonna put this cap on. Come on. Okay, there we go. And then we are going to put her on here. Let's see, guys. One, two, three, four. Okay, it says four drops. Yeah, so it's so negative, guys. 
there's only one line showing. Just one line. So I don't think I have COVID. Oh my God. I mean, not that I wanted COVID, but I just kind of wanted an answer to what I have, you know? But okay. I guess good, good for me. Oh my God. So Evie was eating some hot Cheetos. Look. And he's do not get near my couch. Yeah. What, baby? There's one rule in the house, Evie. Don't get near the couches, okay? You understand? I love you. So I'm coming outside because I wanted to plant some tomatoes and then also some jalapeno peppers. I don't know. Okay, so we just uh planted this not that long ago this is spearmint yerba buena and then where is my um uh, where is it at okay so my grandpa and ruben uh planted yerba buena right here and then on this side i think what is it that they planted oregano so this is our oregano Oh my god, it's so cute. And then this is my avocado tree right here. But look at you guys. I don't know when these are ready. They're still really, really green. Look at this. They're really hard. So I don't think they're ready. But I think I will plant right here right let's plant right here Okay guys, I don't know if, I, if I'm doing this right, but if not, whatever. I tried. Wow. Me? Okay, look. Let's go to the park. Come on. Let's go to the park. On our way to the park. Hi. I love you. Yeah, I think it's through here. nothing but donkeys and horses and sheep look at all this this could be me but I had to bring up my phone because my battery died but yeah a new one? They did, babe. It's brand new. The other one was yellow. Come on, come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. I feel like we just came. Yeah. Wow. 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 Oh, is it closed all around? It's closed. I told you it's closed. Oh my god. 
How? I know. How are we gonna tell him? No, he's so happy. You guys, my poor baby. It's because they just built this brand new playground, and it's closed. What, baby? It's closed. It's closed. Oh, you're trying? Wow. Wow, baby. Oh, baby. I feel so bad. Come on, baby. Let's, no, babe. Let's go through over here. Come on. Over here. Look at this one. Babe, what if they're not on right? You guys, I want to cry for my baby. It's okay, Evie. It's closed, baby. Where's another one? We gotta drive in the car. I can't get you in unless I throw you over. You guys, I'm so sad for my baby. Hey, he's pointing. What? Unless we take him to those playground ones, no, huh? Like last time? Yeah. I mean, we can. I feel so bad. Here, tell him that we're leaving. See what happens. Let's go. Tell him if he wants to go play baseball. Come on. Let's go. We can't get in, baby. It's Damn, closed. Look, we tried. We have a little cord if he wants it. We tried, baby. I thought it was open on this side. I'm Here sorry, baby. <laughs> Baby, it's close. <laughs> oh, baby, we broke his heart. Let's let's find another park. I know, baby. I'm sorry. So instead of the park, we're doing this. Wow, baby. Bye. Oh my god. That really broke my heart to see Evie like that. Like I shed a little tear, but it just hurts to see us parents see like your baby so excited and then like it not happen for them. Oh, I was so sad. Now I need to get a wee little playground set. It just broke my heart. Look at Fernando. This is how he brings in the trashes. I am also going to boil three garlic cloves and a piece of egg. I might have overfilled my pot a little bit, but oh well. <laughs> you guys we are in the behind the scenes mm -hmm. with mo money cooking for her channel yeah, doing a little cooking video whatever what are we making or you what are we you making we are making um enchilada oh, oh. <laughs> not the not the stove difficulties back here stove on fire um we are making enchiladas verdes cremosas Mmm. Oh, you guys, Fern, I actually brought Fern with me this time because last time we were in a little dispute, but we're good, so he's back there. Did you spark them or what? No, remember last time? Well, were you here? No, you were gone, so you weren't here. So you didn't know. Don't know the cheese. No, Mo didn't even know the cheese because she was at my mom's side of town, so. Yeah. So it is now the next day guys. I'm currently editing. I forgot to close out the video and I was just so into the mood yesterday at Brittany and Mo's house that I forgot to finish vlogging. Um, but Mo's enchiladas were so fire guys. I can't wait for you guys to try those enchiladas out on her uh, YouTube channel. Uh, but anyways, if you guys have any ideas on any video ideas for my and friends channel, let me know down below because I really need some video inspiration like maybe sit downs i don't know mukbangs anything like that with me and fern i know you guys don't really get to see fern a lot 
So I told friend like, you know what? We should do more videos with you and them because everyone loves to see friend. I don't know why, but <clears throat> I'm slowly getting better, guys. Each day is getting so much better. I think it's like allergy season for everybody right now. I can't seem to like open my eyes. Like it just, uh Please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be doing a hundred dollar giveaway. All you have to do is comment on your cash app down below, and I will be sending one lucky winner a hundred dollars. And I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye.